Hello everyone and welcome back to another edition of Why I'm Buying, where I talk about stocks that I personally hold in my portfolio. This doesn't mean I'm buying it right now, I've actually been holding most of the stocks for a while, I'm just making a video of why I like the company. So today I'm going to be talking about my only food stock, Domino's Pizza, DPZ. Uh, ticker symbol. It's currently the world's largest pizza chain. It just passed Pizza Hut with 2.88 billion in revenue, $278 in profit, and it has appreciated about 212% over the last five years or so. So it's been on a roll lately, and I don't think it's going to end anytime soon. And this is why. So Domino's is huge. It's huge all over the world. The revenue is just about 50-50 US international, which I love to see. And just get this, they're in some very, very lucrative markets. So pizza is huge in India. Who would have guessed? So they're huge in the US, obviously. Uh, 4,876 stores. India with 1,195. UK with 1,100. Mexico with 760 and Australia follows with about 693 and they're adding on stores very rapidly. Now all chains are adding on stores hopefully but Domino's is adding on more than most because they have a strategy of that builds uh, on really adding stores in close proximity to the customer who wants their pizza. Now before I get into more about the company the, the first and foremost reason for buying Domino's is because of pizza. Pizza is the food of the world, everyone loves it, and it offers more variation than any other kind of uh, all-around food, be it a burrito or a burger or a hot dog. A pizza can liter literally be anything. It's not necessarily that fattening or unhealthy. It's just a dough with some sauce, some cheese, and then you can add whatever you want. It's pretty cheap, it's fast to make, and the competition is there, but it's not that big. Internationally, they have Pizza Hut, but other than that, it's mostly local chains. So Domino's is really the only massive player outside of Pizza Hut, and Domino's has sort of been passing Pizza Hut as, as of late, so I think that's going to continue. So Domino's has posted some incredible numbers. Just running down some of them, they've grown same store sales, for 30 quarters consecutively, never done before, no business does this. They've grown revenue by 20% for the last three quarters, so that's 60% in total. And the traffic to their stores have grown by 7.4%, outpacing the average pizza industry, which is sitting at 1.4. I believe this was 2017 numbers. So they are crushing the industry pretty much on every single metric. Now, the reason for this outperforming has mainly been their adoption of technology. So they have the best website, the best ordering process, they have the fastest deliveries, uh, they have a great app, and uh, um, they, they are experiencing with self-driving cars for delivery and all of that, drones or whatever. And I think if any delivery company, fast food company, is going to be able to deliver to you autonomously, it's going to be Domino's. They also use a, a fortress strategy for their stores, which means they're building as many stores as possible so that the food is never far away from you and you will always get a very fast delivery. Now, uh, for some businesses, this can backfire and end up cannibalizing their own stores, but Domino's has had great success because the demand is there. So fortressing, they're just building, um, you know, let's say they had 100 stores before with 10 miles between them. They're going to have 200 stores with five miles in between them. So they're really just bunkering down, especially in the US, where they know they can take over the whole market pretty much. And one of the signs that Domino's is really on the ball and innovating is that 65% of all orders comes from the digital platform. And in the future, pretty much all orders are going to be done online. So people want to just go on the website, make their dream pizza and have it delivered in 15 minutes. And that's the ultimate dream. If you could do that, the, 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 sky, the space is limit for, for Domino's and I think they can do it. So just like Amazon, they're thinking fast, they're thinking cheap, they're thinking about the whole customer experience. 
and Domino's can use its scale, so all the money it makes in the US and internationally, more than any of the other pizza players, to crush the competition. The competition is small, they're local players, which can be difficult for a pizza chain to beat because the, the quality will inevitably better will be better at these small sort of low profit Italian places and just there's so many great pizza places but people still love pizza and they don't really care whether it's the greatest thin crust pizza or just a good Domino's one and since they're in so many markets and in so many different um, income areas I think they're gonna do fine and uh, the quality has you know really stepped up and it was a time where the pizza fast food and fast food in general had a rumor of bad low quality unhealthy food you know it looked great on the advertisement but when you got it it was just a pile of doo-doo uh, they did run a, a, an aggressive ad campaign and they've really improved their quality and it shows in their numbers so you know they're going to use their scale they're making more money than anyone else they're going to push everyone else out and the pizza market is massive massive just to summarize they sell the number one food in the world they're the best at selling that food they're in some very lucrative market see brazil india mexico you know us uk and so on they're outperforming every single index so every single uh, industry average they're crushing it they're very profitable the stock has had a great run they're innovating it's there's pretty much nothing to say nothing has gone wrong for dominoes they keep uh, they keep pushing they keep innovating and they don't really have much competition showing up so I think it's a great buy let me know what you think do you hold any food or fast food stocks let me know this is it for me I'll see you guys in my next video